Hello, this is Pastor Nick Hood, and I want to share a word with you. In John chapter 6, verse 35, Jesus says quite plainly, I am the bread of life. He, and I would add she, who, who comes to me will never be hungry. He said, come to me. Uh, and then he says, and he, and I would add she, who believes in me will never go thirsty. And I want you to think about what that means. Uh, if you really want to be fed in life, uh, you've got to come to Jesus. That's one thing to eat food and get fed and satiated with what you eat. But what I've found is that even with food, if depending on what you're eating, uh, you, may, you may eat but may not be satisfied. I'll give you an example. Uh, if I'm hungry and settle for a cookie, or a bowl of ice cream, uh, it may taste good going down, but it's not going to satisfy me. Uh, I've been in uh, some rural parts of Africa, in the Democratic Republic of Congo, the Republic of Congo. Uh, I've been in um, uh, Liberia, uh, traveling from Monrovia to a very remote part called River G. Uh, you know, I've been in, uh, in Cote d'Ivoire, uh, driving from Abidjan, which is the capital, in an air-conditioned vehicle. But to drive in an air-conditioned vehicle on a rough road, rough, bumpy road for several hours. Uh, and when you travel like that, and uh, all of that that you're offered is a soda pop, on the one hand, you're glad to have anything go down your throat. But I tell you, a new grape, uh, the orange Fago red pop, 7-Up. Uh, it cannot com compete with water, just basic water, like what I'm looking at right here. And, um, and so when Jesus says, whoever comes to me will never go hungry, whoever believes in me will never go thirsty because I am the bread of life. What I want you to ask yourself is, is your soul satisfied? Uh, is your soul satiated? Uh, is your soul uh, at ease. Uh, when you're going through this pandemic and thinking about all the ups and downs and uncertainty that we're dealing with, are you really at rest? Can Are you at peace with yourself? And if you're not, I encourage you. I encourage you this day uh, to make a decision for Jesus Christ to say, Lord, uh, I accept you uh, as the bread of life. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. And I want, uh, I want to be fed, and I want to be full, uh, and only you can fill me. And so, my friends, that's the word I send you, leave you today, and I want to uh, close with a prayer. Gracious Master, our God, I pray for each of us that you might fill us where we are empty. Uh, I pray, O oh Lord God, that you might satiate us where we are hungry. And I pray, O oh Lord God, that uh, where we are thirsty, uh, you will give us refreshment on a level that we cannot even imagine. Bless us, keep us now always in thy care. Through Jesus Christ, our rock and redeemer, I pray, amen. God bless, God keep you. This is Pastor Nick Hood. And if you like this video, I hope you will click like and subscribe. I'm trying to build uh, my YouTube presence. And I thank you uh, for being a part of this. God bless and God keep you. In case you're wondering where I am, this is Fox Creek in Detroit, and um, I'm behind my brother's house. It's just so peaceful and nice. God bless.